honestly, I think that's the most sensible thing. I mean, you. Whoa! Oh, look at the fake here. Oh, I tell you what, Brian. Oh man, Brian look at this! Ellis. Come on, Brian Ellis. Down to the 30. Down to the 32. Wow! Take a knee. Not tonight. Wow! I tell Anthony you what. Anthony Wales. Listen, you knew they were going to have a trick player too coming to this game, but just the time on the clock, the position on the field. What a brilliant play call by Brian Ellis, the offensive coordinator. Somewhere, if Bobby Bowden is watching this game, he is the happiest guy. Get over there, they gotta, they gotta pull they got it together. It. Here's Brady with a fake. It's Deion Lewis with just a little excitement before the end of regulation. Friday night, how about this formation? This is the play that is called hide the midget. And they hand it off. That's RJ Fleming, and he has room to run. Fleming inside the 30. Finally knocked down at the 25. That is correct. Yep. So this is the view from Ball State defensively. Where is he? This is the whole point of the play is to hide the player behind the line. They can't find him. And of course, here he is. Look at him crouch down. And then he pauses for a second, hesitates, and then takes off. And by then, it's too late. Of course, he's got the speed to outflank the linebacker right there. Set up right here. You see them huddled right over the football. Normally, they break the huddle, line up quick, and try to snap it. Trick play. Watch out. They got a guy crouched. And they hand it off. He comes around, and the trick play works for a first down. You called it, Jess. You got to watch out for the trick play. That was Ryan Davis, the freshman from St. Petersburg, Florida, who wound up with a football. He's 5'9", 164. You see this play run in high school all the time. He's just crouched. You see him right there. He's going to get the handoff. All the action <laughs> going the other way. The trick play fools Texas a and That's the hidden human trick. <laughs> and from inside the Bison 5, three different times. Interesting formation. Mangrabbit's pulling all the tricks out of the bag. Wow. Fantastic play call. And watch the setup here. I mean, they're bunched up. Watch the defense. They have no idea what's going on. And you want to watch this guy right here. That's the tricky one. As he's down, they can't even see him behind the line. They hand him the ball. You will see this play again somewhere on a Pop Warner field in high school, middle school. Great creativity here that led to points. Watch Christian take the snap. That was sweet. For Ryan Smith to turn around and another strike to the outside. David Godley forced him out. Four, six on third downs. Here's some misdirection. And a touchdown as the Bison score a big time touchdown with Ryan Smith. They catch him off guard. The great opportunity and the touchdown, 32 yards. So the misdirection works big time for the Bison. Watch him, he's hiding behind the left guard here. Kind of the fumble ruski. We talked with the coaches, they said they're not gonna do anything different during the week or anything or come out with anything new, but if North Dakota State's doing that all year, that's pretty successful. There's the ball, hey, it's, going, it's going to Neal. Neal taking around the left side, and Neal is in, the old Bumaruski. Here's Phillip Rivers squatting down, watching in gold, they're going, what's going on? But the focus has to be on LaDainia Thomas and the snap. He hands it to Lorenzo Neal, and really a pretty good reaction by the Denver Broncos deep. Right now, they have that old familiar option play. They are third down and five. I doubt that you'll see them go for a field goal at this time. I think they'll take two downs and run it. We've seen them throw the ball in this position three times earlier tonight. They were not successful. You'll see some sort of runner. Big down. Dean Steinkohler, he's in for a touchdown. I was
totally full. The best technicians in the world goes into the end zone for a Nebraska touchdown. Now we're going to see how it happens because I don't know. Well, I'll tell you what, it's one of those guards around. Every good team has one, but you never figure to throw it. Watch Turner Gill come out. Dean Stein Cooler, number 71. He hands it to Old Dean. The ball, he didn't hold it. He left it right on the ground. The only way you can give it to a lineman is you got to fumble it. He cannot take it and hand it to him. So what he did is he got it from the center and left it on the ground. See if guard, you talk about flexibility. Watch it. Now the ball goes right on the ground. Right on the ground. Stein Cooler picks it up. He just left it there. You can't tell me that that's not a planned play, but he has to fumble it. And Kevin Kiley. Thanks, Bob. It's anniversary time in Tallahassee. One year ago, the punt Ruski. It's now one of the most famous plays in college football. With a minute 33 to go in the game, it's 21-21. And here's the short handoff and the little handoff to the up back. Leroy Butler's got a long way to go to the 40. Leroy Butler to the 50. Leroy Butler to the 40 to the 30. Leroy Butler to the 20. Leroy to the 10. Leroy Butler knocked out of bounds at the four-yard line. What a play by the seven. Awesome razzle dazzle. Now the ball is snapped to him. He takes it up here. And this guy here is sitting like this. <laughs> You know, very original. <laughs> this stunned crowd at Clemson is just awed by the guts of that plate. Why did you do that? I wanted somebody to win. <laughs> we were determined. Off Connecticut. Spiffy Evans back deep to receive for Boston College. It's a fake. On a fake punt. That is taken by Abdur Rahman. And he is free. Nobody knew he had the ball. But now he has the end zone. Jamal Abdur Rahman from 47 yards and a fake punt touchdown to get things started in 2013 for Villanova. And the coaches told us about this play potentially coming sometime early in the game. They talked about snapping to the front man. If you see the first guy gets the snap, puts it on the ground, and now he's gonna slip off to the left side and then skate his way down to the field. No one within five. Save the touchdown. First to 10 from the 11. They snap it back. Stucky tries to extend the ball. He's going to be a little bit short, I think. And touchdown. There's the signal. And let's take another look, Rich, here at the touchdown. Well, you're going to see Chancey Stucky. He's going to be lined up behind the, the, right, the right guard, Bill Yates. What they're going to do is they're just going to hand the ball to, to uh, Stucky. And it's all about illusion and disguise. They don't think they're ready for it. Stucky, he's hiding behind the big offensive line. The offensive line reacts, and New England is caught off guard. I don't feel that. Can you feel that thing? That's oozing out your doggone hands. That thing is beating your doggone chest right now. Can you feel that? Can you feel what's about to happen on this field, man? Whatever you got today, I got to have it. 